Hi, this is Michael Goldfarb with SideFX Software, and welcome to this second part in our introduction to Apex. In this series, we'll be looking at Apex Graph and Apex Script. We'll start with an overview of the asset that we built in the previous course. Then we'll move on to look at Apex Graph, its UI, how to add nodes, how to wire them together, and discuss some of the basic concepts. Then we'll add a small feature to our asset using a manual method uh, that is to say, editing the graph by hand. After which, we'll build a component script so that we can add this small feature uh, in a more procedural and reusable way. Then we'll look at Apex Script and how it's related to Apex Graph. And again, we will add this small feature uh, to our asset using Apex Script. The feature that we're going to add to our asset is very small and might seem uh, inconsequential. But in doing so, we'll be looking at all of the basic things that you'll need to know uh, and the workflows that you'll be using whenever you use Apex Graph or Apex Script in your rigging. I hope you get a lot out of this course, and if you have any questions or comments, uh, please feel free to contact us through all the usual means. Enjoy the course.